Please introduce yourself and who does what in the band. Steve Gregoire, lead guitar and vocals. Adam Root, bass, vocals. Dave, drums. Nathan, I sing and film. Number two, how did you guys meet and how did the band get started? <laughs> yeah, recommendation from Cooper Anderson producing the album right now, the new one. Nice. Also uh, through Craigslist, met these guys and uh, they were working with Ken Lewis who I've worked with in the past, so I was really excited to get on board. Number three. Um, how did you come up with the band name Man on Earth? I didn't. You did. <laughs> Just came out. Number four. How long have you been together as Man on Earth? Well, I've been in Man on Earth since November 2005, right? No, before then. <laughs> I was in five. Somewhere around there. Sorry, sorry, 10, but it's a long day, man. By the way, this is Al, our buddy, Al works Rock. at the studio. Works at the studio. This is where we rehearse. Not in this room in particular, but in general. Next question, number five. Favorite song to perform live? My current song to perform live would be Coming Closer. Hmm. Um, Fallen Stars or Stanch Bone. We shut on. Sometimes. I don't play anything, sorry. <laughs> he has a but, he's, but he has a face for TV. <laughs> number six. Question number six. Favorite memories with the band? Uh, South by, and then we just played a show at Gramercy Theaters. Oh, yeah. So that was a lot of fun. With the simple plan. Mine was probably recording this new record and our time at Cooper's tracking. It's Duxion. awesome, awesome. <clears throat> Coop Duxion. Uh, Coop Duction. Wait, actually, you know, we should ask Al, what's your favorite memory with the band? I don't know. Eating too Chinese long, food? Too long. You could be eating Chinese food. It could be eating jambalaya. <laughs> oh, jambalaya was a good yeah, one. Yeah. Yeah. Root cooked some good jambalaya. Oh, yeah. All right, next question. When you're on the road, what do you miss the most? And what is your favorite food to eat while on the road? Two parts. Uh, home, I miss the most, and uh, obviously, and then... Uh, I don't know, something, something that doesn't make your stomach sick is okay with me, so. Um, I miss my bed. It's the best thing to eat. Is there anything you get for free? How about that? Some bands has a motto. Does yours. If so, mind sharing. If not, it's cool. Is there a motto? Weez don't have a motto. Move it on. Don't fuck up. Handle. Yeah, don't fuck up. Uh, spearheading. Don't fuck up. Stay tuned. Yeah. For more mottos. Next. Number nine, dream place to perform at and favorite state to perform at. I'm gonna just quickly say MSG would be my favorite place to play. Dream place, I should say. Um, and favorite state, I don't know, we talked about Hawaii, <laughs> about how Elvis played out there. <laughs> how great. Uh, that show that Elvis did in Hawaii, that's where I wanna play. <laughs> Someday in my life. If you weren't in a band, as of right now, what could you see yourself doing? I would be a chef. Most no doubt would be. Hopefully retired. <laughs> Isn't this supposed to be realistic? All right. Any more questions? <laughs> Number eleven. Yeah. Well, we're on. We have five more left. Uh, well, Number eleven. If I'm you could exactly. cover any song, what would it be and why? What was the question? If you, if you could, could cover, cover any, any song, song, what would it be? Something from Rush. Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I love Rush. You know what? I'll give. I'll. I'll, I'll do the Rush one too. Something from Rush. I mean, to play fucking some Neil Peart. Why the fuck not? Yeah. It is all. It would, it would be all about the drummer. Then fuck the rest of the band. Number. <laughs> <laughs> I don't really okay. care about anyone but Neil Peart. Where could you see your band taking place in the next, oh, say, five years? You want to answer that one? Sure. Um, in the next five years, wow, a lot could happen in five years. So. Hopefully, as the ad for mentioned, uh, MSG would happen, um, since it's right down the street from here. So that's what we're hoping to do. Number 13, for the people who hasn't heard or discovered your music, mind explaining or telling what the style is? It's like, was it eclectic? Uh, it's like rock with a little bit of electronic stuff going on in it, definitely. Uh, who are some of your musical influence? Uh, Chili Peppers, Blood Sugar, Sex, Magic, definitely changed my life. Yes. Mm. A lot of Woody Guthrie and Lead Belly. Nice. 
Uh, anything from Chuck Berry to Trey Anastasio. Uh, number 15, final question. Thank you for asking all these questions. The final question is, is there anything you would like to say to your fans? Thanks, and album comes out in September 2011. Check us out. Our new album comes out in September. Uh, please tell your friends about us. Follow us on Facebook and Twitter, and come out to some more shows. Yeah, September, things they never believe. Coming out. Hey, friends. Cool. Man, I know that cool. Thank you guys so much. You're awesome. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. Ha, <laughs> ha,